okay, so you have your Facebook lead ad running and let's say it's been running for a few days and you're like, geez, I wonder if I have any leads. So instead of just going into ads manager, even though ads manager will tell you the number of leads, you actually have to go through your publishing tools. Okay, so you go to your page. If I'm running uh, Facebook ads through my Search Salt Lake page, you have to go to publishing tools. And then on the left side, you scroll down here to the uh, forms library and then you find the lead form. And right here it shows you your lead count and if you know a bunch of them might be expired if they're from a while ago. And then right here you can click download and that downloads a CSV file. But guys, that sucks. Nobody wants a CSV file. I'm gonna show you the best way to do it. The best way to do it is to use something called Zapier. Z-A-P-I-E-R. Now guys, I'm sorry, but Zapier is gonna cost 20 bucks a month to have an instant response, to have an instant notification of your Facebook lead ad, and to send that information somewhere, whether that's to an ISA, to your CRM, to Agentology, to whoever you're using to respond to your leads, or you know, especially getting them into your, your CRM, you need a bridge like Zapier to connect the lead ads with your CRM, the lead ads with Agentology, lead ads with your ISA through a text or an email, right? Zapier is the system that does that. Now I will say, the only system that Facebook connects directly with is MailChimp. You can set up MailChimp to where any new leads automatically go to MailChimp, but that's just an email system. You're gonna wanna call and text. So what you do with Zapier, um, let's see, I'm logged in here to mine. I'm just gonna go in and show you my zaps. Okay, so you set it up, you just pick Facebook lead ads and Lion Desk, my CRM. And then I also have, this is what's great. When you're paying the 20 bucks a month for Zapier, you can do these, um, these three-step zaps, they're called. So my Facebook lead ads sends directly to Lion Desk, my CRM. It also sends an email. That email goes to Agentology, who I use for my ISAs. They respond instantly. This is an automatic system to where the lead goes right to my CRM, of course, and my ISAs, and they can respond for me within five minutes. That's only possible using something called Zapier. Now, there is one more option. It's not nearly as robust as Zapier. I do think that the 20 bucks a month for Zapier is well worth it to have. Otherwise, your Facebook leads fall through the cracks. You have to go look in your publishing tools and then download a CSV file of your leads. Like, how stupid is that? But there's also one called LeadSync. It's only 10 bucks a month. LeadSync.me. And for 10 bucks a month minimum, uh, you can get a 14 day free trial. Um, they'll connect the leads from one Facebook page and then send you an email, okay, to one email address. You can do that for 10 bucks a month. I still think paying 20 bucks a month for Zapier is the best option. But that's, I'm sorry guys, that's just one of the hoops we have to jump through with Facebook lead ads, unfortunately, but it is what it is. Um, they work so well the Facebook lead ads work so well at getting leads that I'm willing to jump through a few more hoops to service those leads and respond to them quickly. Okay, so back in Zapier, you'll sign up, you'll do the $20 a month deal, um, and then you'll just, in your make a zap, okay, so you just find the Facebook, Facebook lead ads, see it's a premium feature. Facebook lead ads, and then you pick the trigger is a new lead. Of course, you're going to connect this to your Facebook account. Mine already is. That's why it's doing this. So you do that. And then you set up the page. And then you also pick the lead form. So if you have 10 different lead forms for different ads, you can have a separate zap for each one. And each one you could send to a different place. You could put each one on a different drip campaign through your CRM. You could send each one to a different person. It just depends. So that's why Zapier is so great is you can send the lead wherever you want it to go through an email, through a text, through a direct integration. So then you pick the lead form. Okay. And you just follow this through here. Connect and continue. And then uh, the next step. So this is the trigger. Then what do you want to happen? The action. What do you want the action to be? So then this is where you can pick your CRM or maybe it's like follow-up boss or oh, no top producer, lame. 
wise agent CRM is in here. Whatever your CRM is, chances are there's an integration um, to hook up with lead ads. Guys, I hope that helps. And I'm going to be talking more about how to automatically respond to those leads. But that's how you get them. You're going to have to have a service like a Zapier to, to send these leads to you automatically when they come in. And you could even set it up here. Like I could also add a step right here to this Zap that it would also send me a text message. A text message comes through my CRM when it's automatically added there. That's why I don't need one. But if you if you want a text every time it comes in, Zapier can do that too. You just go in here and add a new step to the Zap.